What's going on guys, it's the Cobra this year, and today we have another episode of the Jack and Daxter HD Collection. And first of all, you want to see this crowd? Okay, so there's a couple of things that are kind of glitchy. Look at that lady that's having a seizure. She's indirectly in front of me. I don't think she was programmed to work at 60 frames per second, which is freaking hilarious. I saw her every time. But okay, now we're going to be taking on the races. So yeah, this is post-commentated. Um, this was amazingly frustrating for me because it took so many tries trying to get through this thing. And as you can see, I, I constantly raged of how badly I started. I didn't want to crash into anybody. I didn't want to crash into the walls. I had to get everything down packed and right. And the way I figured to do this is jump over this guy, get this turbo, and fly my way across this thing. Um, and yeah, I did fly on the map a couple of times and die. Now, taking the shortcuts is also one of the best ways you can win this match. Is by jumping across the chasms like that. And pulling the brake is probably the best thing you can do in this game. And getting two turbos like that is also another way. Now, you want to turn really sharp. You don't want to turn too far and drift into the walls. You want to turn right down the middle. So pull the brake or press L1 and R1 to jump your way through. And grab the turbos as much as you can and fly into the air like this is really cool. I really like these zoomers. I wish they had them in the city challenges. And I think this is like the only time we're ever going to be playing with these. And whoa, that could have been right. That could have been it right there. It took me an amazingly amount of uh, tries to beat this thing. It was crazy. Now, NPCs can die during races because of how this race wasn't perfect and the AI wasn't perfect. Now, if you guys know this, um, instead of three races that we actually have to beat, there's actually six. Now, three of which you can't see unless you get a certain amount of orbs and unlocks reverse races in the, uh, the secrets. So once you get the reverse races, you're going to have to do those as well, and that's another nine orbs. So total, six times nine is 54. So we're going to have about... Uh, 50 orbs to get from this place alone and you can't miss any because if you do you're not gonna be able to beat this game 100% complete And that's what we've been aiming for so that's a bit of a fail right there And this challenge isn't for everybody not everybody's gonna be able to beat this race and it's very very tedious and difficult But if you guys do a lot of practicing like I did I took three hours Maybe or four or five and a bunch of rage quitting to get this done uh, You will get it eventually you just try your hardest and you'll be able to do it anyway um, And yeah, that should be about it now, I'm going to be doing three of the class races in this episode, and then maybe uh, the next three in another, and then that should be it. I, I actually know I glitched at the end. I couldn't find the last three, so I had to redo the entire game in one day and get every single orb off of my Let's Play, and I did the exact same thing. I think I glitched and missed three of them from a race or something. I searched all my files, could not find it. I know I didn't miss any during the... Uh, the campaign mode because uh when we were doing the story i checked everywhere i went back and checked everywhere and all the challenges were done everything was done i don't know what happened uh i re-beat every race but there we go guys yeah um i beat every race after that it was crazy i had to redo the game and i'll be showing you guys that later on but um yeah i guess we're gonna be starting jack 3 maybe next week i have to do all the bios and stuff this weekend it's gonna be a lot of work but i'm hoping that it all comes through and hopefully 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 it comes out properly because uh Usually on the first week, it's always the hardest for me. I have to make all the bios in that one week and all the charts and whatever. Um, it's actually a lot of work. And I, I don't like the fact that other YouTubers, they don't put any effort into the videos and they get more views than me. It just anno always annoys me. An annoys me. And uh, yeah. By the way, guys, today's the. Do you know what today is? I'm actually recording this on. 420 happy 420 guys <laughs> I, I don't know how many of you guys like actually smoke weed uh, I don't judge you guys if you guys do I, I really don't care it's just that um a lot of people oppose it and then there's a lot of people that are just really cool with it I don't care I'm not one of those people and I actually have a couple of cool stories if I could ever fit them into a commentary uh about 420 it's actually pretty funny kind of cool kind of stupid as well of course it is. I mean, like, everybody was so hyped about it yesterday in school, and I'm pretty sure nobody showed up to school today, because uh, I didn't even show up to school today, because there's not any point in me going to school right now. Uh, I am in high school, I'm in senior year, but we don't do anything. I, I get out of school at about 12 o'clock. We don't do anything. The teachers have pretty much stopped teaching us. Um, and it's only April. It's just that because everybody already knows what college we're going to, it's not really any point in uh, us having to try to even... Uh, exceed because you're already in the college you don't need to show off your grades anymore and the, all you have to do is actually just pass it to 65 nobody nobody even cares anymore it's just that easy but I heard as soon as you turn 18 it goes downhill from there so I'm, I'm not really happy about that that's really gonna suck maybe by then I'll be making some YouTube money <laughs> so that I, I won't have to be so depressed but anyway yeah um this is lap five of this race 
Now, I didn't even mention while I was going through my little uh, story there. Don't take this shortcut right here. You want to turn around this corner and take this shortcut. It's actually even better and faster, and it'll help you win this challenge a lot easier. And as you can see, I'm just blazing through the course right now, trying to hug down the middle of the track, because that's the best way you can do this. And there we go. Okay, now, uh, I think this race was about 200, 2000, 2 minutes and 9 seconds for the challenge. Uh, I'm not really sure. Let's see. Alright, now we're at the final challenge here. Uh, well, here you are now. This race is actually the race where we did with Errol, but he's not alive anymore, apparently. And he won't be here, <laughs> which is pretty funny. Um... Now, those two turbos are really closely put together, so uh, right here, you want to really try to stay down the middle, but see what they did? And Naughty Dog knew that down the middle is the best way to go on these maps, but right here, you want to pull the brake on this turn at all times. Always pull the brake on that turn, it's the hardest to go through, but if you pull the brake, you'll save a ton of time when not crashing into the place. And using turbos to back up your turns, really good maneuvers right there, that's what you want to do. And um, go for these two turbos right here if you can. But yeah, Naughty Dog knew that down the middle is the best way to go, and that's why they put this hole here to really throw people off. But this turn is what messes up this course the most. If you don't pull the brake right here, you see I'm trying to fight it so that I can use the turbo to recover. You won't really be able to succeed at all. And uh, yeah, as you can see, I just did three laps within like 55 seconds, so that's really, really fast. Um, and uh, yeah, just follow what I'm doing, listen to what I'm doing, and you should be good. I know a lot of you guys already got the Platinum and are waiting for Jack 3, but what do you guys want to see after Jack 3? Maybe I shouldn't be even talking about this until Jack 3 is over, but what do you guys want to see? I know Jack 3 is actually a rather short game. I actually played it the other week trying to do a quick run of it, seeing how the game was after a while because I didn't even play it for that long before. And, oh man, it was still one of the most amazing games. It actually, now that I think about it, it's actually on par with this game. In my opinion, um, it was more funny, more action-y, more gameplay, uh, acceptable, I guess, I don't know what to say, it was just that good, I, I really don't know why people haven't played these games yet in their childhood, um, but yeah, that's, that's what I have to say about it, and I will be trying to do the bios the best I can, because I found a bunch of really cool things, but I can't get anybody to edit for me, because I'm not that big on YouTube, guys, and not that many people want to help me out, and that, with my limitations of not being a partner, no, not really that many people want to help me out with thumbnails and stuff, so, yeah, that's, that's how it is. I really want to do thumbnails, because thumbnails are where to attract people, and I really want to do cool ones per episode, not like the ones that other people do where they just show episode 1, episode 2. Now, I want to do really cool pictures of Jack and really show off some artwork, but uh, that's it, guys. I think that's what we're going to end things off with after this part. Um, Really short episode, I know, but I really want to get this down in the next episode, so I'll be seeing you guys later. This has been The Cobblers, and I'm out. Peace.